is Repulve Gaming. Welcome back to Stray. We're in Midtown now. <laughs> Got to somewhere different, right? So how's everybody doing? How's life? Because we got more cat things to do. Does anybody have a pet? Oh, Clementine's picture. High voltage, keep out. It looks like some kind of battery goes here. So imagine we don't want to put a picture in there. It might get fried. But yeah. What's up down here? Our cool little phaser thing. X-ray machine. UV light thing. I don't know. It's purple. Oh. It's broken. So feel a little naked without a weapon. Oh, well, we got claws. Those are pretty deadly weapons. Look, this is a subway station. Yes. I had completely forgotten this kind of transportation existed. You could ride to anywhere in the city. People used to take it to go to work. I used to take it too. Every morning, after saying goodbye to my family at home, I remember I was doing this for them, but they are gone now. It was so long ago. They wanted to see the outside, but does that even matter anymore? What happened to them? What happened to everyone? Anyway, we're near Midtown now. Let's find this Clementine. We have a picture. We can show it to someone of the companions around here. Maybe they'll point us in the right direction. I mean, look at this train station, right? It's like something you'd see out of like modern, the modern day era, right? Even these seats. <laughs> Tiles. Yeah. Where's all that like space age paint? <laughs> you look like a rabbit. Okay. Um, I forgot how cute this game was. I've been playing so many other um, more dark, grim games. Metro. We just had to deal with a bunch of cannibals. But, yeah. Oh, many machines. Uh, too bad. We couldn't get that guy some more music, huh? We'll be alright. If they're making their own music with their AI algorithms, they'll make more. Translate. The metro is closed due to pandemic restrictions. Please do not enter. Any violation of rules can result in a heavy prison sentence. That's a little too close to home. <laughs> oh, there we go. There's a companion. Hey. Oh. What are you looking at? There are so many books here. The Turing Test Legacy. The Ethics of Artificial Intelligence. I recognize some of these. Did I have a library? I remember nothing was quite like the smell of books and the turn of a page. It was a feeling, almost like comfort. A book was like spending time with someone. Hmm. I mean, nowadays we all have Kindles, cell phones, you know, smartphones. With these large screens. The phones are just getting bigger. <laughs> and uh, I personally prefer uh, scrolling up and down. I think I can read a book faster. But having a book is, I don't know, it's so old school these days to me. I'm sure people still use them amounts, but everything's gotten pretty digital. This guy is not saying anything. Oh, okay, yeah. Hmm. Cat got your tongue? Oh, oh, hey, what are you running from? You just ran from like a, a sealed door. Your hands are up. 
There's like some kind of police. The guy's a nightstick. Very quiet here. I already told you five times, Yosh. You can't run around like that, it's dangerous. Mm. Hey, this is the first time I've seen this kind of robot. You look so fluffy. Oh, it's the girl displayed on this wanted screen, right? Uh-oh. You should ask someone else. I'm too busy with Yosh here to know anything. Is that really her? Hold on. How can we tell? It's hard to say. I mean, it's the same hat. Like, it's like that, uh, that taxi driver hat. This person doesn't want to talk to us. What's that say? Neko? Don't worry about trash Neko. The corporation, uh, copyrighted. Takes care of everything. Okay. Oh, there's another monitor. Or is this a slot we can jump onto? This is a big city. This is is this all Midtown or is it bad down there? I can't see any like corruption of the the Zerk down there that I can see anyway. That guy's getting frisked. It was like Chicago or New York. They, they got a drone too. Usually you don't want to run up to police officers like this while they're busy. Just let, leave them, let them do their job. Please state your identity. Cooperate or we'll have to transfer you to a jail and reboot you. Oh, wow. That doesn't sound good for a robot at all. Peacemaker 22106. Please leave me alone. I'm not the one you're looking for. If you're looking for Clementine, I'm sure she's hiding in the residence. Oh, that's her clue. What kind of drone do you think this is? You think it's got any weapons hidden away in it? Like a taser? I mean, it doesn't look like there's anything in it. Maybe like an infrared camera? Access to lower levels is restricted, restricted due to organic life hazards. Please keep out of this area. Organic life hazards. That's a nice bow tie they wrap on our things. <laughs> Oh yes, it's the the cuddly Zerk Menace that is over there. You don't want to mess with that. Let's call it for what it is. Jeez. Okay, there's nothing... Well, I didn't look that hard, but... Maybe we can run around the chain link fence. Oh wait. <laughs> I mean, it would be a bad idea to show that picture. Oh, it? <laughs> hey, you're having a good day? Yeah? Oh, wait, hold on. I thought he was gonna walk somewhere. Oh. Okay. The guy is a little bit more well put together. Catwalk achievement. <laughs> How to be a ninja? I just I just noticed this book. Five. Where's uh one through four? You already you already progressed that far, my, my friend. Huh? Well, tell you what, you watch and you watch from me, and we'll teach you how to be the best ninja ever. We dodge zerks and everything. Hmm. Consider this. Tomorrow, if I replace my arm with another robotic arm. The next day, my other arm too. And then my body and so on until I've replaced all my parts and upgraded my software. Will I be the same robot you are talking to now? Of course not. But that's like the, uh... What's it called? The Perseus ship, right? I can't remember what that, uh... Philosophical debate was about, but... Oh, hey, what are you showing me right now? A bunch of people I don't know? My guess is that they probably live in a massive housing building for their town. Do what you want with that. Oh, okay. The massive housing complex somewhere. Is that up there? Oh, I got some like. I just want to flip them over, see what they are. 
we're, we're such a menace. Because <laughs> I don't flip over. Uh, maybe like a, a sound card of some sort. But yeah, like the... Was it Perseus? I want to say. It's, it's the one with like the... The journey where they go kill the Medusa and all that kind of stuff. And... Hey, I'm off work to... I'm off to work. See you later. Okay, honey, be cautious of the Sentinels. They are quick to make a rest for no good reason. Don't worry about me, babe. I'm good. Um... There was like this uh, wooden ship that they had you know, they used to travel in that, that mythical adventure. It, it was Odysseus, right? Not Perseus. And, uh... Yeah, they, they had to replace each board one by one and it was just like... You know, the, the original materials of the boat wasn't there. Residency Shop Street. Neko Core. But the idea was that it was still Odysseus' boat, right? But was it a different boat? And if we did the same thing, you know, if we replaced all our, like a human became a cyborg, right? And then we transplanted our consciousness into a robotic brain, would we still be the same person? Right? There's something to keep, you know, so is B12 the same person as the scientist, right? That's kind of like the question we're, we're hinting at. This merchant crook sold me a faulty battery the other day. Now he just pretends not to hear me every time I try to confront him. But if it wasn't for the sentinels on patrol, he'd end up as spare parts. Uh, this guy is low on battery, apparently. He's also, like, static. What's wrong with this guy? 2458. Uh. Dot dot e d o c. Oh, what's that? I saw something shiny. Or maybe it's just reflections. Oh, there is a safe up here. A four digit code. Is that on here? 2458. Okay. 2458. 2458, 2458, 2458, 2458, 2458, 2458, 2458, 2458, 2458, I don't go up. You know, in comparison to the slums, though, I mean, it's obviously pretty good. Look at we got these old, like, halogen ball things, bulbs. Is that what they're called? Halogen? I don't think so. That's not right. Like the old, like, Thomas Edison bulbs. <laughs> I can't remember what they're called anymore. Shit. My memory is so bad. Bouncer. Club's clothes get lost. Hey, have you seen this person? Oh yeah, who are you? At least everyone's looking for it. You don't learn it if that's what you want to know. I'm gonna just walk up there. He's up walking up and down the street. Hey, that guy looks shady. Maybe he'll know something. <laughs> Blazer, I'm busy. What do you want? Beat it. Okay, he doesn't know anything. Space. Yes! <laughs> but wait. Are we, you telling me that we have to hide in boxes now? Is this stealthing in this game? This place looks sketchy. Hmm. Uh, that's a construction robot. Hey, bud. What's up? Try little one. You can't play over here. The Neko Corp factory is no place for a fu little fuzzball like you. Access is dead, but only for a little while. If you can wait a few years, we'll open right back up. 
You say a little while, but you're saying years. Cool picture. Is that a dress on the back? Yeah, that first symbol is a street. Then there's a floor and a door number. Should be pretty easy to find. Oh, cool. Thank you. Do we do we look at the picture? Uh, examine R. Uh, rotate. Huh. Looks like a a domino or something. Yeah. Okay. So I should take a picture of that with my phone. I mean, it, it's in the game, eh, right? Is it? <laughs> what am I thinking? Yeah, it's like something like on my desk in front of me, or like hold it up to my face. And the game's kind of doing that for me. Hey. At MechaCorp, we work all day long to gather the waste and send it downstairs where they recycle and repurpose it. Speaking of downstairs, it's been a while since we had bad news from news from You sure you're just not dumping it down into the slums? That seems to be the case to me. There's another dark alley here. Where a bad cat would kick cans down the road in the street. <laughs> Come on, <head. laughs> who, who told you to do that? Man, somebody's been bullying this guy. You been in the city below. I had a friend there. Uh, Fifi. I haven't seen him in ages. Okay. Maybe he just likes it. I don't know. Seems like it'd be a hassle with a cone in your head. You know, that's supposed to be on the ground if there's a wet floor. And also, you missed out quite a few spots, just saying. <laughs> oh, this guy. Hey. What do you guys sell? Some of those cog wheels I saw someone throw in the trash before. And get picked out of it. Hey, you look a little down. Oh, you are down. Okay. I used to own a bar. It was the coziest place around. Until I took a screwdriver in the knee and it's closed now. What? I guess it's a Skyrim reference. Even if this guy bums me out, he's my only customer. Try not to scare him away, please. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. Oh, there's another hole to jump through. For a minute there, I thought he was actually trying to cut hair, but he's, he's actually like... <laughs> I kind of want to see what he's up to. Wait, me? Ouch, huh? What's that weird feeling? Talk was... was slippy? Wait, huh? You know, work is work, Slippy. Don't lose your head about it. <laughs> That's funny. That's... Huh. That's great. Human personnel only, and then... People get to put on different heads. That's pretty cool. I don't think I've ever heard this type of music in a barbershop, though. Usually it's like... I don't know. Sorry, the shop's closed. I'm watching for the delivery guys, but it seems they're waiting. They're taking their sweet time. Yep. Waiting on those uh, deliveries. Another sentinel guy. This guy. Hiya! <laughs> oh, look at it. Looking at them. It's the trendiest shop in Midtown, but the shopkeeper is pretty grumpy. Okay. <laughs> it's so odd looking at a robot do this, you know? They're acting so human. Y you'd think they'd be able to imagine, you know, process what it would look like. As, as, as humans in general that programmed and, and maybe made these guys, they're also you guys are really well crept. Like there you can see like there's like these whatever that is, it's rubber or silicone or whatever it is. Maybe a carbon fiber.
but like we I guess we didn't program into this model to have like any extra features you know but then humans have been away for so long you think they'd be able to upgrade themselves at that point are you you the one those punk, young uh, are you the one those young punks listening to loud music all day don't touch anything don't make any noise don't ask for credit okay or sneaky cat. There's not. Wait. <laughs> the register doesn't have anything in it. It's not even a digital register, I don't think. See, this monitor is newer, right? Sort of. It's a flat screen close to it. Okay. But then this phone was paired with it. It's like something from the 80s. Night or like, yeah. Those cat statues are pretty popular. Wherever you go. I guess robots aren't that creative. Oh. <laughs> oh, what are we looking at? Insert item. Looks like we can have a cassette tape. <laughs> and uh, I guess if we get this guy kicked out for some reason, maybe there's something in there that he drops. Okay. Uh, Q? Uh, no humans will stop us. The robots know, know better. <laughs> Wait, is there anything out there? Uh, jump. And. Oh. There's like a. that. Gas can guitars. Okay. Oh, let's just figure out what's going on. Oh, wait, hold on. What was that? I thought I saw something. Yeah, never mind. Maybe it's just that circle. Okay. This place is so interesting. Hmm. There's probably a whole, like, secondary roof, too. These holes in the walls are the best places. You never know they exist, and then when you finally do, you'll be like a regular customer every day. And you'll be like, it's a jealously guarded secret. You don't want anybody else coming to it because you want you don't want your seat taken from you. I mean, these guys aren't robots. They fall asleep on the job. Like, come on. There's no way. They're way too programmed. Too well programmed, if anything. What's the point of this? Hey, uh, officer, I'm looking for a street. Uh, uh, Sentinel? You, you guys call each other? Those look dangerous over there. Hey. Plus, I just walked near the elevator and I got yelled at by the sentinels. For years, we have been told that the surface is uninhabitable. We just accept this as fact, but why? It's true. I mean, I came from the surface. What's this? Oh, what a lovely photo. I think it looks familiar, but I can't be sure. Our drive is a little buggy these days. Sorry, I can't help you. You should ask somebody else. You know what, my friend? Stay away from the Sentinels. They're vicious and they got my buddy Pablo. He's in for 350 years. So be careful. Wow. These guys got super totalitarian. He doesn't even care about cats. Go away! Shoo! Shoo! <laughs> How can you dislike cats? I'm afraid to touch this wall. Hmm. It's a force field. Okay. What's that? Okay. 
It's not a store over there. Well, they're regular citizen folk. Seem fine enough. They like cats. Hey, you got anything cool? <laughs> We're on the go. What can I do for you tonight, chef? Or chief? Is it chef or chief? Hey, do you know this person? Can't you pay me with real money? Uh, that's, no, 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 that's not what I'm after. <laughs> These robots don't care. I mean, it's like that, uh... You keep poking at it to see if it's real or not, but then you finally find a chink in the programming, right? That's like, oh... They're not programmed for that. They're, they're actually not, like, humans. Aww. <laughs> That's so adorable. Aww. That's so cute. Yeah. <laughs> I guess we go where we please. Oh yeah, I keep panning out for these these screenshots. Come on. <laughs> yeah, get it. Okay. That's cool. What do we got here? Okay. Oh wait, we've been in here. Hold on. Let's get a little lost. Wait, hold on a second. Uh, tab right. Uh, examine. Yeah. Okay. Looks about right. Oops. Tab. We gotta do a little more exploring. Looks like a sushi bar. Tried downloading an aimbot to be the best at this game, but it ended up with a malware. Not sure why, but everything seems odd now. Like how how odd? Huh? Oh, <laughs> his face is upside down. All right. Let's see. I've mastered every game that ever existed, but I can't figure out how this one works. Am I not seeing the whole picture here? You talk about billiards here? You just hit the ball. And then, you know, there's nothing really to it. You pick up one of those, you put a little chalk on it. Gotta get good. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I don't know, Tonin. I like pretty much everything. Me, month. Hmm. Uh, who am I talking to here? What will it be today, little sir? The world must seem gigantic from your little eyes. Wish it could be as tiny as you so I could explore new hidden places. You know, this is a good point. If I could shrink myself, would I? My favorite drink is oil. What's yours, Mimoth? Or would I want to be a giant and like roam across the lands? That's an interesting choice. Hey kids, don't do that, by the way. I people. I, I don't know. <clears throat> Just don't huff air canisters, okay? You can easily die from that. What's up here? Hmm. I'm seeing a lot of cool, like... It's the same one over and over again, right? Or at least close to it. These images of, I don't know, the... Some tropical coast. Some beach. 
Could be Hawaii. The Bahamas. Man, I haven't been to one. A tropical coast like that. At least I don't think so. But it's like one of my dream things to do. Go sit on a beach with the, where the sand is super white and soft. The water is super clear. Like crystal clear. That you can see fishes in it. Without even having to go in the water. No. Okay. Isn't it so cool right now? So chill. I think that nothing bad could happen to us. An e-cigarette, huh? That's that's interesting. And we're going towards where we're supposed to go. Huh. Are you you waving at a camera here? You shouldn't do that. You might piss somebody off. Hey, dumb face. We can see you too. Okay, yeah, I, I understand why you're doing it now. This guy's going back and forth with his boombox. Man, what are you up to? Life is boring since the Sentinels put cameras in our residence. That is super intrusive. Cassette tape. Hey, those tapes are ours. Don't you know not to steal? I could give you one, but you'll have to do something for J Jamama and Miko and me. The Sentinels have installed three security cameras to watch over us. We don't like that at all. Can you get them off our backs? Will I? Oh, I mean, yeah. There's totally. I'll be one. I'll be back in one second. A chance to mess with the authorities. I mean, not that I, you know, I don't know. but in a game like this where they're 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 not really like. So how do I mess with it? I guess the power supply to it. Hold on. Mm. Ah, there we go. That's one down. I rebel. Ha ha. You never take me alive, coppers. How do we get up there? Oh, maybe here? And then here? And then here. Hiya! And whoever installed that needs to get fired. That was a little too easy. <laughs> just just for good measure, okay? Yep. Mm -hmm. There you go. Now let's go get that cassette tape. Progression. Maybe I can make a shortcut. <laughs> oh, it looks so happy though. We gotta see the robot. I mean, that's way better than a robot. Come on. All done. I didn't think you could do it. Here, take your prize. You've earned it. Guess that too. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Enjoy your song, you'll love it. Yeah, we'll come back to this part, but it's like one of those, I oh, forget to do it kind of things. Then I'll do it now. It was, uh, that clothing place, right? It was like down here. <laughs> How do we turn this thing on? It is pretty loud. Am I supposed to do this thing now? I kind of want to touch stuff. Oh, <laughs> I 
is so loud in here now. Okay, what are we what are we trying to steal? What are we trying to break? Um, what's up with all the fur on your butt now? Jeez, it is so loud. No wonder that woman, er, robot lady complained about it. It was, yeah, it was really loud. Hey. <laughs> I guess we're just being a menace. I don't, see the I don't know, I feel like I'm missing something. There's a lot of headbanger stuff, but <laughs> we got a mission to <laughs> I could stay there a while. At least some uh some hearing for the future. Too many decibels. <laughs> that was great, though. Okay. I wonder what is in that safe. Hmm. What do you mean you forgot your character sheet? I spent the whole week preparing this session. Even these guys play, like, Wait, what do you mean, forget your character? No, no, hold on. That's not what I'm trying to talk to you. I'm sorry, I forgot where I put it. But let's play anyway. I'll go into that cave. Let's go. Some kind of role-playing game. Probably D&D. &D. Those nerds. <laughs> I play D&D. &D. <laughs> Is this it? I don't, it's not it. I don't think so. I got this one group I, I play with on Sundays, and uh, I actually play a tabaxi, but he's like Tony the Tiger. It's, it's pretty funny. What's that noise? I oiled up, oiled up all my bearings last month. He's um, was it a barbarian? I can't remember which kind. Berserker, I want to say. We got another box. Hmm. Uh, let's see the picture. Oh, picture. Yep, yep, yep. Uh, examine. That's what I wanted. So, three, five. Three green, three, uh, red, five. Green, three, red, five. Got it. And tap to exit. Hmm. What's that number, is it? That's the green three, and then three red. Or not. We need two more. What are you exactly? A quadruped making cute sounds. I like that concept. I do too. I very much agree with you. There's a one that way. So are we on the wrong side of the hall? I think we are. There's our door, but it's like all boarded up and everything. Okay. Space bar. Run away! Might be copyrighted. <laughs> I mean the the booming music and the. Oh, we got, what do we got in here? Um, hmm. Door is padlocked from the inside. That's a strange way of doing things. Anything on the calendar? No. You got a no money symbol here. Like no dollars. But there's like one extra line, so it's like Is that the new like US dollar crypto kind of deal? Crypto dollar? From the future? I don't know, kids. If I believe in crypto yet. Technology is great and all. The uh uh oh. Oh! Hey! Chill! I thought you were a sen 
You're a sent. Never. Oh, sentinel. Never mind. Who are you? What do you want? Okay. Answer me. What are you doing in my house? Wait, so Zabrotazar finally decided to send someone. I guess from our new recruit, you're not very big. How did you even manage the sewers? I guess you must be pretty resourceful. I've been looking for a way to the outside ever since I left Ant Village, but the Sentinels are always watching. Now that you're here, you can help. Follow me. Follow me. You talk very fast. Even faster than me. One fifty 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 you know. I'm not an auctioneer, but <laughs> What's up? You got this like uh corkboard deal going on here. Okay, I see something leads to everything here in the middle. What's that? Hold on. Uh no money. We got cans from somewhere. We got a train leading up to that. Okay, we got your wanted poster sign. And we got this dome, it seems. And what's that green thing dealing? I don't know. It's a question mark. I can't read language, so Clementine, why don't you help me out here? <laughs> I've been working on a plan to use this old subway for a while now. I even have the keys to start it. All we need is an atomic battery to power it. I know Nico Corporation has one secured inside their factory. I have a contact who can help us demonstrate them. I don't know his name. He's the robot with the bomber jacket and a gold chain. Take this message to him. Someone small and swift like you should have no trouble sneaking inside the factory. One last thing, don't hesitate to ask around for help. This city is full of information. Just stay clear of the sentinels. Okay. We have a mission. A more actual direction here. Let me just check the recording. We're 42 minutes in, so this is a good place to stop. And we're already here at a checkpoint, too. So, yeah, if you want to see more, go ahead and subscribe to find out what happens in the future. Later. Bye.